Hello there and welcome to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Camila and on this channel you can find, well, I guess a bit of everything really. This intro is gonna be a little bit longer than usual because there are a few things I would like to mention and talk about. And the first thing being that I would like to apologize to my current subscribers that I haven't been uploading as often as usual. Uh, the thing is, I have just begun school and this is uh, a 37 hour week, the school, so I haven't had the same kind of time on my hands as I well had before. And obviously I really, really hope that you will be patient with me and stick around because I have so much fun with this little community that we've built together. And I really do appreciate you all. So I hope you'll bear with me if the uploads are a little further apart than you're used to. The second thing I would like to mention is that I have decided to take my cleaning videos to a separate channel. And there's an explanation that comes along because when I uploaded my cleaning and time-lapse videos, I gained subscribers, but as soon as I then uploaded another type of video, I would lose all those subscribers just as fast. The type of viewer that wants to see these cleaning videos are not at all interested in the rest of my content, and thus I have chosen to do a separate channel where I put my cleaning videos. And if you'd be interested to follow along on that channel, it's called Time Lapse Cleaning. It's so basically just videos done on time lapse where I do the cleaning and the housekeeping and maybe some, some other chores. Anyways, as you can see from the title, today is gonna be all about a trip we are doing, a shopping trip to Hilavel. But before we do that, we obviously, as always, have to take care of Gilbert. So uh, I'm gonna take you along to the dog park with me and Gilbert and some of Gilbert's dog friends, even though he doesn't wanna play with them, but never mind. That's basically what I have in store for you today. At the end of the video, Clara and I will be doing a haul of what we got during our shopping trip. If all of that sounds good to you, well then keep watching. Wanna go for a walk? Yeah. As you can tell from this footage, Gilbert doesn't like to play. <laughs> he uh, keeps mostly to himself, just sniffing. He's a hound dog, Beagle's a hound dog, so he's mostly interested in just sniffing. Here I'm trying to give you a view of the beautiful nature in which we are walking when we are walking the dogs in this local area. There's Gilbert on his own once again. All right, so I'm getting ready to go to Hilohal with uh, Brian, my husband, and Clara, my daughter. I've just been a uh, out in the dog park as you saw with Gilbert and it was a really nice um, walk. Now we promised Clara that we would go shopping in a, a town nearby so that's what we're up to. So I'll just finish up doing this hair and maybe you know try to make my face look half decent <laughs> and then we'll just leave. See you up there. One of my goals for this trip was uh, getting some uh, wrapping for Clara's school books and fortunately we did find it in BR, this Danish uh, toy shop. Uh, BR is a toy shop that's been around in Denmark ever since I was a child actually. For those of you who don't know, Lego is actually a Danish company, so obviously there would be a lot of Lego in a Danish toy store, and there is, as you can tell.
Clara has such a sweet tooth, so obviously we couldn't pass this candy store. She just had to get in there, and they did have a lot of different items that you don't see many other places. We had a look around, and Clara, she picked out some stuff in there. As soon as we stepped foot in the store, we actually found out that this was more of uh, collector's items than it was, you know, just some plain thrift shop. So we decided obviously not to buy anything in there, but we still had a small look around. So here's the footage of that. This thrift store is run by the Red Cross. If you buy anything in here, you'll be donating to charitable courses. Unfortunately, we didn't find anything of interest in here. This store is actually kind of a funny one. I think maybe it's the equivalent to the TJ Maxx in uh, the United States, but I'm not sure if it's completely the same. You can buy all the known brands, but for much cheaper prices. I'm not sure how they managed to pull that off. Clara loves this shop or store because there are lots of different items and candy and so forth. So we did actually get her a few things in there and I had my eye on the eyeshadow, but yeah, that's the nature of being a mom. Even though I thought it looked really good, I just, didn't buy anything for myself. So here we are at Rodes.dk. I've actually been in this store in another one of our shopping vlogs, but I'll link it in the top for you in case you want to see more of that. But today we actually had a special errand inside Rodes because Clara recently picked up live action role playing and inside of Rodes they have a huge department of uh, role playing gear. And here you see the role-playing gear department. Sorry, I don't know what exactly to call that. Clara really wanted one of the weapons, but they're expensive AF. <laughs> so we want her to try it out a little bit for a little bit longer before, you know, investing in this very expensive equipment. But uh, as you will find out later on in the haul, we actually did get her something for her role playing in here. bit of a haul uh, to show you guys what we got and we, oh, can... we can start with this oh yeah uh, because my uh, friend got it I got it to this Copenhagen pride for me yeah Clara uh, would like to support the LG I bet the L... LGBTQ uh, IA yeah Please. community so we got her those bracelets and then just boring side note and mouse pads super light well, yeah they are very light uh we'll start with uh, not the food not the food uh let's start with my thing and pack it out yeah i got a cake for my role play i recently picked up a um, 
live action role play and uh, she's an uh, elf what do you call elven it? elven she's an elven and now she's got herself a cape and as you can see here let me just make a little time. maybe actually this angle is better i just think we'll leave the camera there because i'm hunching all of the time look at that what a nice elven girl can i be here too yeah. so that was the cape we got that in rosas yeah and then what yeah, else we got mom got a deodorant deodorant yes mm -hmm. and without perfume because uh, i don't like perfume in my um, product hello is this why you show it with this pyramid see the beak here It's magic! I like the wings though, they're so colorful. So there's a small party trick for you. <laughs> I, can, I can do this, I can check out this. There we are. A balancing bird. Oh, and by the way, where was this from? Bulls. Bulls. Uh, we got these jelly fruits. Could you pick one out of that? To just, you don't have to open it, just to show. Yeah. Is it jelly inside? Yeah, or? they're like different kinds. There's also this. And then you break it open and like yeah. sort of like with a straw you suck it out. Yeah. That's from the candy store. You saw it in the clips that we were in a candy store. Uh, we got this uh, soda. Yeah, soda is pop. That, this soda is actually really good. We got that in uh, the candy shop as well. Oh, and we got the, uh, we got some rare uh, the dark uh, magazine. Yeah, because I like collect them. And this was made in my birth year, 2009. Yeah, so that's pretty fun. Having a Donald Duck magazine from when you were born, from the year you were born. And we have, oh, uh, some book covers for my school. We got a lot because we got a lot of books. So a lot of book covers. What is. Oh, all right, I think we may have. Uh, we may oh, have... it's cool. Oh, okay. We thought we took black ones, but then some other patterns has have snuck in. I'm sorry. I got a message on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> we were both like, what is that? We're going to put those in Clara's school books. She's got a lot of school books. Yeah. I think this is the cutest one. I like this. Yeah, I also like that one. That's really cute. Oh, and we got this in a PR, the toy store, store I was filming in. And we got caramel popcorn. Ooh. Yeah, enough talk about PR. Yeah. yeah, and those were from uh, normal or normal in English, but in Danish we say normal. Oh, and we also got this uh, bath bomb. Bath bomb! Because I thought it looked uh, cool. And I think it's gonna smell really good. Look at it. And that one was from normal or normal as well. And then there's just something on here. Oh my god. Well, anyways, I guess we'll round this video off here because, um, yeah, well, not much left to say actually. Bye. <laughs> um, as always, I really do hope that if you enjoyed the video that you remember to hit the like button and uh, maybe even consider subscribing if you like my content in general. And I guess I'll see you guys in my next video.